What is going on guys? Welcome back to another TMIR, which is this month in rugby video. I hope you all had a nice Easter, unless of course you're Israel Folau, which has probably been quite a miserable month for you. But we're not going to get into that. We are going to be reviewing all the little action in rugby as a sport. Throughout this month, we're going to be avoiding all the massive games. We're just going to be talking about the little things that have gone unnoticed. And if you're a major fan of rugby, stick around, you'll love it. Before we get into today's video, please make sure you go ahead and leave a like on this video to show your support. Please as well, make sure you go and comment and let me know your opinion at the end of the video. And also, please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already to be up to date with all our videos as well. And please click ahead the notification button so you're notified whenever we upload. And lastly, please go ahead and follow us on Instagram. Okay, so first off, we're heading over to the 7th circuit where there's an amazing try scored by the Argentinian team. As you can see here, this great skill is being shown. Uh, this is an analyzing thing from the World Rugby YouTube channel. But it really pinpoints the skills as well from this Argentinian play. And yeah, what a try scored. Okay, so sticking with the 7th circuit now, take a look at these two plays from the Uruguayan team. Uh, just straight after kickoff as well, they've managed to receive uh, from the opposition and just literally run down the whole pitch. Uh, as you can see at the clock there, that's literally like 11 seconds. Uh, and then they go on to then restart the game and catch their own kickoff. Here shows how high the ball actually went up, as you can see. And they catch their own ball, pass it back, and pass again, and create a play, and go on to score another try from the kickoff. So again, amazing play from the Uruguayans. Next up, we have a different sort of thing to show on this channel. We had a streaker over in the Chiefs vs. Blues game in the Super Rugby, uh, as you can see. But it's an amazing play from him, to be fair. Like, he steps one security guard, then he steps another, manages to keep running. As you can see, three of them running after him. He's not even going that fast, so it's quite poor from the security guys. Uh, and then to, yeah, be absolutely destroyed by the guy in the black clothes. But either way, I don't know, he probably might be a rugby player, who knows, uh, somebody should sign him up. Okay, and finally, this is the last clip of our video today. Uh, we're going to be heading over to Shane Williams in Japan. He's doing a series on the World Rugby YouTube channel. And yeah, basically it follows him and a special guest every single series. Yeah, I just love it, Shane. Uh, this one is with Lee Mears, the ex-England player. And they go on to explore all of uh, Japan and it's weird but interesting attractions. Here, as you can see, is like a theme park. We're being made up as characters from the traditional Japanese theater, Kabuki. We then later go on to do a bit of history with the Japanese and dress up as one of the traditional art things. I don't know what the tradition is, uh, but as you can see, uh, it's quite funny to watch. And yeah, it's pretty hilarious. I'd go ahead and watch it on the World Rugby channel because as you can see in these clips, it's quite funny seeing Shane Williams dressed in something that you would never imagine him in. Okay, without further ado, that is going to be the end of this month in rugby. Obviously, it's uploaded in May, so we're actually looking at last month's clips, but again you get the message uh so yeah please leave a like if you've enjoyed today's video it was a bit shorter than the last one but then not much has gone on in the rugby world besides the big games being shown uh and again i can't show them because of copyright reasons so sorry about that uh please leave a like if you've enjoyed comment let me know what you thought uh and let me know if there's any clips i've missed maybe i can show them in next month's one as well uh please go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already we're gaining loads of subscribers like I couldn't talk then, I'm sorry. We're gaining loads of subscribers lately. It's great hearing from all of you. And yeah, it's great helping this little community grow from something that used to be like 10 subscribers. So it's amazing how far we've come. Our target is a thousand, and then I'll be quite happy then. So hopefully we'll hit a thousand by this time next year. Who knows? We've managed to hit nearly 200 in just two months. So it is doable easily. So if you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe, comment, let me know what you thought and your opinions or anything you want me to do with this channel. Please like the video as well and yeah, click the notification button as well to be notified when we upload. I've been Andrew, thanks for watching, peace out.